एज इज जस्ट नंबर टाइम इज ऑल रेलेटिव सो इस एवरी थिंग दैट वी पुट लाइक द फाउंडेशन ऑफ टाइम द फाउंडेशन ऑन एज इज इट रियली लॉजिकल और कम्प्लीटली इज रैशनल और इज वॉर आई सेम कम्प्लीटली Hello everybody welcome back to the tarot tanvi i am tanvi this is my studio these are not my tarot cards these are my astrology cards that i'm going to pull towards the end of this video so please stay with me before i go on and talk a little bit about the concept of time i would just like to say that please don't forget to pray for world peace the world is filled with haters the world is filled with a lot of hate we need more people who believe in unity we need a society and the society is made up of you and me me and you all of us together so let's believe in peace let's believe in love and not, let's not spread more hate in this world okay so i personally believe that the concept of time and you know putting timelines on our lifetime is completely illogical okay so understand this we say or we think that we should uh, get married at a certain age we should be in a relationship at a certain age we should have a job at a certain age earn specific amount of money at a certain age right uh, so and then as we grow up we realize that we are unable to match our expectations our parents expectations the society's expectations of time you know having children on time getting married on time but what really is this on time is time really real well isn't time just a man made concept that helps us organize things put put it uh, on schedule in order and help you know communicate on time with each other but at the same time when time is taken too seriously when it comes to timelines of our lifetime it becomes overly uh, exaggerated and unnecessary so let's understand whether time is real or not time is just a man made concept right like we say that we will uh, one year is uh, whatever 365 days because we uh, calculate that as per the earth's movement around the sun now tomorrow if uh, somebody says that let's not consider sun as the center let's take moon uh, for example in i think in india uh, we follow the moon cycle so now years would be different right so around if you if you talk about like a moon uh, going around the earth that would be a completely different concept now albert einstein was of course he was a genius and uh, he understood this entire concept of relativity and time being entirely relative and not what we assume time is okay so for example when we are having fun we don't really care about time all right but at the same time when we are waiting for somebody when we are stressed we really focus a lot on time then time seems slow so again time is extremely relative so when we say that we all should uh, get married at a specific age have children at a specific age our children should grow in a specific way when they are in a you know uh, when they are of certain age they should know these many languages they should do this and that so these are all unreal burdens don't you think like tomorrow if i say like let's follow the moon instead of the sun will all these concepts not just vanish away so is following time really like um, a logical thing you know when it comes to our lifetimes and making life decisions just think about it okay so i'm going to pull your astrology card let's see what we have so we have two fire signs we have aries with i am and leo with i will so uh, these two are fire signs uh, which talk about uh, well aries in tarot is uh, the emperor and leo talks about the sun card so emperor and sun this really talks about you stepping into your authority you knowing who you are uh you know not caring about what people say so combining this with the concept of time that i just spoke about i think this also talks about you creating your own lifetime and you creating your own timelines in this lifetime imagine if you did not have the burden of you running out of time you know that uh, oh my god i'm i'm i don't know i'm turning this in this age hence i need to i need to be at a specific place in my career 
imagine if you remove those foundations or uh, whatever like how your life would suddenly change how your expectations out of your own life would suddenly change and i i have a sense with these two cars that this is exactly where you're headed i feel that um, you know um, if you have this inkling of uh, this entire concept of time being uh, entirely man made and not necessary to you know follow these uh, timelines but i do feel that you are stepping into a time where you will be very sure of what you want the more sure you are of what you want out of your life the, the more decisions that you take out of your will like you know of uh, deciding of what you want what you desire what your needs are you know the more it is about you and not everybody else not the world not the society not parents not children not anybody else but only you you know the more you trust this inner compass i see that there's more um happiness because sun and leo energy is all about confidence is all about happiness is all about uh, unlocking a lot of wealth as well and a lot of determination so yeah so where like uh, wherever you are trust that you are always at the right place and at the right time and you have the power to change your life as per whatever you want okay So yeah so that's all that I have for you today and I suddenly <laughs> cut the deck half open and we have Uranus which says genius so you are an actual genius I don't know if somebody has never told that to you I mean, how can someone not forget to tell that to you you are an absolute genius we all are I believe but people who are watching this video you're definitely a genius so go believe in yourself do the things that you want to do for yourself okay Yeah, so that's all that I have for you today. I hope that this was helpful in some way, and please don't forget to to pray for world peace. Okay, bye bye. Take care.